And welcome back. Uh, very excited about this. Very excited about this. Drive by the Port of Stockton all the time. There's always something happening. Uh, so I called them and I said, hey, what if we spend a day at the port? And uh, Jeff Wigfield said, hi. Hi, Jeff. How are you doing? Good. Great. Good morning. How are you? Good. Okay. So what's our first adventure on the port today? What are you going to show us? So the first thing we've got to show you today is part of our zero emission equipment that we're installing. Uh, this is the largest zero emission rail car mover working in California uh, at this point. And so um, over the last two years, we've really made a conscious effort to replace some of our, our diesel powered equipment with uh, more environmentally friendly zero emission equipment. And so we just recently received this uh, Zephyr zero emission rail car, electric rail car mover. Um, we've been putting it into operation. Um, we've been greatly uh, excited about its, its uh, operation. It's able to pull about 25 to 35 uh, uh, full uh, rail cars out here at the port. And so we're just kind of excited to showcase some of our new equipment that we're putting into operation. Yeah, that's really cool. Uh, I thought it was a Zephyr when I first saw it. No, I'm just kidding. I don't know anything about this. Uh, yeah. <laughs> now, when you say zero emission, is it, is it electric? Is it like my old HO scale train? It's all electric. It's uh, lithium ion technology. Um, and they've been, they're able to work out here each night, 10 to 12 hours, pulling up to 10 to 35 uh, rail cars at a time. You can see the efficiency and how easily it is able to pull these, um, these cars out here. So we're really pushing to reduce emissions at California ports, and Port of Stockton is doing our part to, to, to do that. Uh, and this is just kind of the beginning of putting into um, uh, use about 36 uh, zero emission cargo handling equipment. Wow, that's really cool. And, and not only is it helping out in the environment, but I imagine uh, sound wise, it's gotta be a lot quieter too for the folks who live around it. It's definitely a lot quieter. Uh, obviously the, the air quality emissions uh, are a huge benefit. Um, but one thing too, we're hoping that it's gonna be cheaper. Uh, we're still kind of trying to gather some of the information about costs, uh, electricity versus diesel fuel, but uh, early indications are that, that we're hopefully gonna save some money as well. Very interesting. Okay, we're gonna check in with you uh, next hour. What, what do you have planned for us next hour, Jeff? Next hour, we're gonna look at some of our cargo handling equipment, our, our, our zero mission heavy duty 36,000 pound forklifts. Yes. Oh, so yeah, be baby. On some steel. Yes. Yeah. We're excited, Jeff. We're very excited. <laughs> All right, we'll check in with you in a bit, man. And we're also gonna look at their owl cams. They have uh, owl oh, boxes yeah. with live cameras in them that I'm kind of obsessed with. Very I'm kind cool. of obsessed with it. So we'll be doing that at the port all morning long. Uh, Courtney, back to you. 